All right, guys, Silver Stacking Rockstar back with you here again for another video. Um, I've got this one all set up, ready to try it again. Um, I've done something a little bit different this time. I kept the piece from the last cast, which uh, was kind of like my tree. I call it a tree. And I used that since it's one piece put it in there and put my Pez at the end of that. I'm gonna keep the Pez in this bag with some powder, baby powder on them to keep them uh, dry and and so they won't stick to the clay, make them a little easier to get out. But anyway, so I put that all together, put the tree in there, put the Pez in there and I smashed it really good and tight. In fact, I even put a block of wood behind it and put it in my press you probably can't, yeah, you can see that. So I smashed it real good, made it really tight. And then I took my handy dandy um, torch tip cleaner because I was using a little copper wire to poke a hole in there for air holes. And that wire was bending when I was smashing it by hand. So I was pretty sure this was going to, it was, it, it wasn't going to be able to get through there at all since I smashed it with a press. So it's going to be really tight. And, um, they look pretty deep, the Pez holes. Hopefully I didn't get no slippage. It didn't slide side to side or anything. But anyway, this tip cleaner worked really good. Poking it in there and, and making an air hole. And I just put, I think... Yeah, one air hole on the bottom of that one. I got two. I got one air hole on the bottom on this side, and one air hole on the top on that side. So the air holes are on top on this side, and on the bottom on that side. So I don't know. We'll see how this works out. And because I used that tree, uh, some of my silver. So I brought two more buffaloes down here to melt and uh, so I'll make sure I have plenty of silver I don't want to run out of silver on this pour so anyway we'll uh, we'll get this uh, melted down and cleaned and I'll make the pour and we'll see what happens all right guys it looked like it poured pretty good but we won't know till take it apart. I don't know if I can do this with one hand or not. I don't have a tripod set up for my camera. Get it around here where we can see it. I got a pretty good plug on the top and you probably can't tell but it is really shiny there is a lot of luster in there so proofs in the pudding right here we go all right well I got good pins so far Looks pretty good. Let's see. Okay, it don't look like it slipped side to side. All right, let me, uh, let me brush this off real quick. Kind of hard to do this with one hand. Boy, she's shiny too. I like that. I like that it's really shiny. Shining like a new penny. 
or a new nickel. And I can see Pez in all of them. The words, the other letters, I mean. The word Pez. All right, let me get this cleaned up and uh, I'll get back with you here in just a bit. Uh, I think we got a good one. All right, guys, uh, this is preliminary, but they didn't slip, so they actually came out pretty square, which I like. Now I've cleaned them up a little bit. Um, I even um, sanded off the cast uh, casting look on them. Well, it's kind of a rough look, more like, let's see if I can get... The cast look is kind of like that. And these are a little more polished. A little more sanded. But I don't know. You guys like uh, the cast look better? Or the sanded look? You know, like, or the polished look? I kind of prefer the polished look versus the cast look. But I think these are good, and I think I figured out what I was doing wrong. But, uh, they look, they look pretty good. Now, I've still got to cut them off, obviously, and uh, clean up these ends. But, uh, preliminary, preliminarily, uh, they look pretty good. I'm pretty happy with them. So, that's what we got. I think they came out pretty good. Like a little tree. And it's pretty cool on this tree. You can actually work them around and, pop, you know, keep them on this while you're polishing on them or sanding on them or whatever. And then just do the last bit, you know, when you cut it off, cut the corner off and uh, clean up the corner. Anyway, I think I like them. Let me know what you think.